Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing the Bicycle Venom Strike uh, deck. This is like basically the twin pack for the ben Bicycle Venom deck, uh, and you'll see why basically because in here it includes a back design of this, and they're made by the same company. So let's move straight on into the deck itself. So straight away on the front of the box, oh by the way, you can pick this up from UK Magic Tricks. Before I forget, UK Magic Tricks, check them out, link in the description below to pick up this deck just here. So on the front it has Bicycle, with a copyright information sign just there, with its big Ace of Spades on the front. The original Bicycle Venom did not have an Ace of Spades on the front. It has this snake, uh, that is actually, the previous one had a skeleton, this one does not. It has this really cool kind of uh, Ace of Spades in the background with this um, snake that's kind of laying around. And it has Venom Strike and it has premium playing cards. On the side it has Air Cushion Finish made in the USA. And it has uh, the United States Playing Card Company with some copyright information just there. And it has their website and copyright information just there. And it has their website just there with a black United States playing card seal. The back design, as you can see, has a black border or no border. It has these skeletons um, that are kind of kept coming out of this bigger skeleton with this snake here, a yellow snake there. And it looks really, really odd. Okay. And it has this black. And on the tab, it also has some copyright information. And the whole way through, it's pretty cool. It's not embossed at all. And it's just a bicycle stock air cushion finish. You get inside and the deck has a white border, not a black, and that is the same for the, ben the Venom deck. So the cards you receive are quite standard, you're probably used to these, but it's a bit of a trick. I just said that as a joke, because they don't. Watch this. First of all, you get the two Jokers. They're quite standard, but they're not standard. You'll understand that in a minute. It has Joker Joker, and it has like Medusa, I think her name is. And the one that turns people to stone, I don't know, and it has a mirrored joker, and they're always useful for magic, you know, it's cool to have identical jokers. The back design, as you can see, has a white border going around with these skulls here and here, with this yellow snake there, and I think that's awesome, awesome back, and a joker. You receive a double backer, that's always useful for magic, and then you receive a back design for the Bicycle Venom deck, and then the back design of this. So as you can see, this is the back for this deck, the Bicycle Venom. So let's move on to the cards that you receive inside. So here we have the spades, then here we have the standard hearts that you guys are used to, and then here we have the clubs, okay? You probably think, oh, this is standard so far, what's the card that's going on about? Well, you can see, look at that, how cool is that? You have the ace of spades here, with the same basic thing with the front with the snake going there and the USPTC. The whole pips the whole way through look completely standard, till you get to the royalty, and this is what I wanted to show you. Look at that. Now, the Venom deck has something unique, now the Venom Strike has something unique. It has kind of the snakes that have taken them away, it looks really cool and there's only a little bit shown of them. And you can see there's a snake there, and there, and I think it's awesome. And it's kind of the coloration to them are uh, like a bluish colour, like a navy, like a really light turquoise blue. And they say, or green actually, greeny blue. The red here, we have the pips here and here, with the red there, and it has the King of Hearts, and then you have the Queen the Jacks there. The reds on this deck are a nice red, like a kind of a darkish red, not too bright, and a standard bicycle pips. Same with the clubs as well, the whole way through. These are basically the same like the ace, the spades, and then the same with the diamonds, with the pips, the same placement as before, with the standard the whole way through, with the same customization to the royalty. So let's see how this deck handles. So first off, this deck does dribble really nicely. It springs really, it springs really good. I've had no issues with the springing on this deck whatsoever. Uh, Rich Shuffle on this deck does that with ease. Okay, because it's bicycle stock, air cushion finish. And it, it's just an all round nice deck. It flips great. Fanning on this deck is really easy, no issues with that whatsoever. As you can see, it fans great there. And I can show you, you know, it fans really nicely. But other than that, it's a cool deck. We can do a giant fan. Okay, as you can see when it focuses, maybe not, it won't focus, but you can see it ferros really nicely. And if you want to do a giant fan, it giant fans really cool as well. But other than that, it's a really, really cool deck of cards. Uh, you know, Charlie A cuts does that easily. Color changes, like if you want to do a double lift and stuff, it does out of ease because of the bicycle stock. Not a lot of inks, so there's not a lot of, you know, there's no chipping on this deck whatsoever. But it's just an all round great deck of cards. So this deck you can pick up from UK Magic Tricks. Thanks for watching my review on the Bicycle Venom Strike deck. Make sure you like the video to show support to the channel. Check out my previous video just up there or down there if YouTube hasn't changed the setup um, once again. And subscribe to the channel just down there. There is a link in the description for a survey and if you'd like to fill that out that would be very supportive and that would help us a lot. Thanks for watching this video. Have a great day. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. 
Hey guys, thanks for watching that video. I want you to know that I actually am right now in Florida, so I won't be able to reply to any comments. I went on the 4th, um, that could be today, and I'll be coming back on the 19th. Uh, videos will still be going up as they are scheduled to go up, so I do apologise if you're missing me, um, but I won't be able to reply to any comments, so please don't take this personally. I'm not ignoring comments. I will reply to all of them when I get back. So I'm in Florida, and I'll see you guys soon. Goodbye.